Today guys, I'll be showing you the Polaroid automatic camera. This camera was built in 1967 based on the research that I have done or around that time. So the camera is closed up in this little case. As you can see, let me pull this part out this would have been the lens right guys and then it's adjustable so you can pull it out or you know adjust it and it comes with a flash I'm not sure the end part that part it seems as if there, there, it, there's a plug-in part but I'm not sure where it is plugged in. You can close it up and it has a strap that you can hang around your neck. Now guys, let me try and open this thing again. Okay, now it's opened. So this is what it looks like when it is the lens is fully drawn out. Now guys, I will be showing you the bag so this camera they would carry this would be the case that you would carry the camera and it's like you can use it as a as a bag hanging around your neck or on your shoulder and it has a little clip at the front that you can close up right and these this is the strap that we're looking at now i also have in my possession the manual and this gives you the instruction of how to take a picture right and it's the Polaroid 210 camera I forgot to mention that while I was talking about the camera now guys I also have in my possession a picture you know that the camera took and this is what it looks like it would take the pic in black and white as colored pictures were not available at that time when it was made now my second item guys is the binoculars now this may not look as sophisticated or like the modern binoculars that we have now so this is the part that you would look through, right? And then you would adjust the lens based on how you prefer the view, right? So you would wind that part up and wind it down to adjust the lens. So let me move this aside. Um, guys, if anybody have any information about this binoculars, then let me know. I'm not sure of the year when it was made. So now, guys, I will be moving on to the other item. This is a Emerson recorder CR45. I would use this recorder to record a song on a blank cassette. Um, you have the option to rewind fast forward play stop this section here is the mic guys so this is where you would open it right and put in your cassette here if you're gonna record you press record this key is not no longer working and then you, you would stop when you're through so this is the cassette record i was trying to get some information on it as to when it was built, the Emerson cassette recorder, um, CR45, and this used to be operated by battery. So you would put the, the battery somewhere here, open it here. So you would use some large batteries in the battery section 
looks like it would hold around four batteries let's close it back up so that is the that is the emerson cassette recorder cr45 i wasn't showing you so this is what it looks like and yes you can carry it by holding the handle here so you turn it upside down like this Right. so guys remember to like share and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already thank you for watching as always and see you on my next video bye bye